Well, I don't know about you boys, but I'm pretty beat. Well, it's too damn bad you never found that Bob character. It seems a shame he never had to pay. Well, funny thing about that, I did have one more chance at him. Back to episode seven. Six months ago, I heard that Butch and Sundance were back in the States and had gathered up some of their old gang. I tracked them down, hoping that Roscoe Bob Bryant had returned with them. So, you're saying they didn't die down in Bolivia? That's what I'm saying. I forgot what that ant manga is called. It's like Psycho Brain or something. There's a there's a high school girl that's a detective. No, she helps with a demon that's a detective. And like the main antagonist is this guy that's like pure evil. And the thing is, they that evilness in certain individuals is carried through DNA and bloodlines. I think a cool game would be one where you're just like following. Essentially, a, a lineage of criminals or whatever. It's sort of like Assassin's Creed, but with criminals. Or maybe it's just a better version of an Assassin's Creed game. I don't know. Ah, damn it, a ranger. Forty years I had waited to get my hands on the last of my brother's killers. Not even an army of demons could have stopped me now. That'd be so cool if we fought a bunch of demons. Both Johnny Ringo and Jim Reed fell fairly quickly. But the last one... Roscoe Bob Bryant. That some bitch had managed to escape my vengeance time and time again. I couldn't even be certain I'd recognize him after all those years. By now, he had to be close to 70. Uh, what was I doing? Oh shit, it was this one. For all you know, he could have been dead. Quick that one. thought had Damn. indeed crossed my mind. As did others. Uh, we'll go with this. Because I'm pretty sure it shoots for faster. Instance, did my thirst for vengeance turn me into something worse than the man I was after? By this point in my storied career, I had killed more men than Bob Bryant ever had. I was furious as hell at that bastard for making me who I am. A man with no family, no friends. Is there a western game with demons in it? Nothing could stop me from taking his life. I've been after that killer forever. From the time I rode with Billy the Kid. But that chapter of my story you already know. Chapter of that fairy tale, you mean? Suddenly it was 1910. There I was, an old man roaming a ghost town dead almost two decades. Let's have it. The town was falling apart, just like me. There we go. Can I hit that? There we go. Anything cool over here? I don't think I've seen a snake in this game. Glad I didn't see alligators. Where the hell was that guy hiding? But I wasn't about to call it quits. Check up here. Oh, I need to go here. There are a lot of bugs in here. Oh, Man, 
would not hang ghosts, around my here. dead brothers were begging me to end what I started so long ago. Mr. Graves, are you all right? Would you like some water? The Wild Bunch knew I was there. They were after a treasure they had hidden before they fled, buried in the grave of a dead amigo. Some folks think the town is haunted, so they figured there wouldn't be many people poking around. I intended to fill that grave with Bob Bryant's corpse. But like I said, the bandits knew I was on to them. They lured Man. me in and hit me with everything they had. They're shooting a lot. That's not very nice. Respect your elders. That was a bad, that was a bad move. Woo. I might die right here. But you obviously prevailed it since you're sitting here telling us today. Actually, in that moment, I did not prevail. So I suppose we're talking to a yes. ghost. Honey, you should put it like that, Jack. Because when I woke up, I was a ghost uh, from the dead. There was silence all around me. Hmm. Now it's Silent Hill. Western Silent I can Hill. I swear to God, I saw Billy then. Billy who? Billy the kid, William Bonnie. He was shooting at me from a rooftop. Here, there, even over there. So oh, I am right. You are titched in the head. <laughs> Mr. Graves, perhaps we should switch you to coffee? You see that old Indian again, too? No, but I did see Billy's killer. Patrick Floyd Garrett. He came at me guns Oh amazing. my god. <laughs> but I knew that old war horse had died two years before. I wondered if maybe I was dead, too, and confronting the ghosts of my past. Perhaps all my sins were coming back to haunt me and, and drag me down to perdition. I don't know what perdition means. I know it's a sword or a blade. <sighs> Ghost is so hard to see. Right there. Oh, this music's different. Bang, 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 bang. I saw Henry Plummer throw dynamite at me. <laughs> Fuck that guy. I hate that guy. Uh... In the gates of the cemetery. I saw John Wesley Harden. Just like I remember. Oh, oh shit. Damn it. I might run out of ammo. Robert Ollinger appeared with his terrible double barrel shotgun. That guy? Oh, jeez. It's a ghost, so of course it goes through surfaces. Hmm, <sighs> terrible shoot. I think ghosts aren't very, uh... Oh, ammo. Okay. Kind of. Shit. 
But no ghost army was stopping me. Uh, what's this one? Uh, my father-in-law got hit with a fallen branch. <laughs> he spent the rest of his life talking to dogs. <laughs> Thank you for covering. Newman Hayes Clanton, William Brocious, John <laughs> Peters Ringo, they all wanted me dead. Oh, they're up from over there. The Dalton brothers, Robert and Grattan, guardians of the Garden of the Dead. Come on, can we get all these guys? There we George go. George Curry and Harvey Logan, alias Kid Curry. Both thirsty for vengeance from the great beyond. Ugh, come on. Jesse, Woodson, James, and Jim Reed. Each one deader than the next. I thought I would go crazy. Thought. Thank you for highlighting them. Despite them being ghosts. Oh. Finally, I saw Harry Alonzo Longabar. Who the fuck is that? Like a general leading his legion of the dead. Oh god. Oh, come on! That dude would have been totes dead. Finally, I saw right. Harry Alonzo Longabar. The Sundance Kid? Like a general leading his legion of the dead. You told us before that you'd seen him alive. He was alive. Oh, come on. Come on. It's one of those kind of fights, lame. Yeah. A voice called to me from afar. It was Robert Leroy Parker, aka Butch Cassidy, coming at me from out of the fog. Thanks for taking care of that bastard. There are so many people. <laughs> so many names. Another double duel? Oh, man. I still want to watch that movie. Ah, oh, come on. But the kid wasn't quite deceased. Not yet. Takes more than one little bullet to kill the likes of me, partner. I shot you with a lot. Those two looked like they hadn't seen each other for quite a while. Clearly, they were no longer amigos. 50-50. She did. I was hoping I wouldn't have to kill you. You won't have to, Butch. I'm killing you first. Are they gonna kill each other first? I asked him about Bob Bryant. But they were too busy with their own heated conversation. Let me get this shit straight. You want my money and the love of my life? You frittered it all away, Butch. It is mine. And so is that damn money. Mm. I didn't want to shoot anybody until I had an answer to my question. But those boys didn't give me much of a choice. Those trees sure aren't attached to branches.
This is so weird. This is really weird. I don't like it. Shit, shit! Ah, oh, shit, shit, suck a dick. That was dumb. Uh, that dude was fast as hell. I need to be on the game here. Shit. Shit. Butch oh. Cassidy and the Sundance Kid died there in that cemetery not six months ago. That was ago. weird. I didn't want to switch because, like, maybe I missed him. Maybe he's two shots. Yeah, it's understandable why that one was much slower. Whew. That one is rough. That one will probably be the hardest one on, like, the highest difficulty. Alright, if you guys like to give a like, if you guys are new, sub. Thanks for logging in, logins. Gear up, logging out.